Hey everyone, it's me, Bailey. Welcome back to my channel. And we are back on Atlantis here. I wanted to give you a tour of my island because it is officially um, done, in quotation marks. Um, and I wanted to show it to you before I destroyed it. We'll get more into that later, but let's get on with the tour. Go over the bridge here on my entrance. Um, we'll do the library later because that's probably one of my favorite parts, but we have a little rose garden slash seating area. I like it. It's really cute. We have my post office. Also love this. Probably top five things that I like on my island. This is one of them. It's just a cute little corner. And if you go down here, we have a little, oh, Sherp is playing piano. So, we got a little um, music stage slash dance area where they can play instruments and sing along to songs that I have playing on. I don't have any songs playing at the moment. And play instruments. And as you can see, it's super cute. Then I have a little record stand slash kiosk here. All of KK's top one number one hits. I, I don't know if they're number one hits or not, but they're some of KK's work. Then we have a little sitting area here. Oh, a balloon. Hold on, I gotta go get that. Oh, how am I supposed to get this? Are you gonna go around the airport? Dang it. Okay, I'll, I'll have to ignore it. Dang it. Um, this is where I keep all my extra DIYs for people who want them. And then we have a little beach area here, which I think is super cute and I like it. And then this little gray path here is kind of like um, a boardwalk. It has a bunch of kiosks and snacks and stuff for people to enjoy. And it go, wraps around where my beach is, so that's cool. Over here we have kind of a sightseeing thingy uh, made for your eyeballs. You stand on these hearts here, and then it says look up, tilt it up, and then you can see it in all of its beauty. It's a bamboo slash Asian, I don't know, theme. But it's green, and it's cute, and I like it. It's got little waterfalls everywhere. Ooh, this is also, I like this little spot too. This is my little lounge area where you can play piano. Thank you. Thank you very much. And also, you know, we got violins and a cello here. And then people can come. Oops, I didn't mean to move that. People can come watch on the little sofa here. I just think it's super cute, and I had to put my grand piano somewhere, so that's where I put it. Anyway, also, I have to show you, this is where I bred my flowers for a while, so that's why it's kind of empty, but I made blue roses. I know y'all don't care if you don't know about Animal Crossing, but you don't know how long it took me to make these freaking blue roses. Anyway. Um, to the right here, I have my little residential uh, place. Everyone has their own little mini yard with something in it. Um, like a hot tub. And like barbecue. And like a kiddie pool. And that sort of stuff. Ooh, I have this cute little sitting area with some of the Sanrio furniture. I just want it to have a place somewhere on my island. So a little wishing well. Moving on, got another little cute area here with a tiny little bridge and some froggy lanterns. Very cute, very cute. We got Tangy's house over here with her orange themed yard and my rainbow garden, part one. I love my rainbow garden. This is the fruits of all my labor of getting every single color of flower in Animal Crossing. Isn't it pretty? And over here, I got my Ayla sisters on the beach. There's a sale on clothes here, that's why this is 50% off. And then behind this, another cute little part of my island, we're open, it is my beach movie theater. Isn't this cute? I just love this so much. It's got little seats so that everyone can enjoy the movie, sit and watch. Right now the credits are rolling. Actually, the credits are rolling for forever, but you can get your snacks. It's got a generator to power everything. And got seating for at least uh, one, two, three, four, five, six people. I love it. It's cute. Cute little part. Got, you know, popcorn stand, a ticket stand, the whole shebang. Now follow me on this wonderful tour of Atlantis. It was technically Atlantis because I spelled it wrong. But we're just going to say that was intentional so that it's unique. I'll go across the bridge here. We 
got more houses over here with their own little yards. Oh, and then, of course, for the Canadian in me, I need to have a Tim Hortons on the island. Get around there. There we go. So this is my Tim Hortons. I just love it so much. You can sit and have coffee and donuts. Hello, welcome to Tim Hortons. How may I help you? That will be $200, please. Yep, that's what it says. <laughs> and then you make your coffee. Mmm, fresh. Also top five. Love it. Okay, anyway, down here we got my little park. And we got, I managed to get my rocks in this circle here, which also took freaking forever. And if you don't play Animal Crossing, you won't know the pain that it took to put those rocks there. But if you do, then appreciate my rocks. Ta-da! Playground goes into the basketball court because obviously I needed a basketball court. Then we come to the campsite, which is also a cute little nook that I love about my island. It's got room for three more campers. And then on the beach here, we have a little picnic area for the campers that I love. A little um, baby kiddie pool for the babies who kind of swim in the ocean with all the sharks. And this cute little uh, sitting area, which I love to sit in. <laughs> And uh, watch the stars at night. It's a beautiful spot. I love it. Over here, we have my orchard, which has my many um, orchards, <laughs> my many fruits and such. Go all the way down to the Tim Hortons back there. And then, I really like this part. It's my Super Mario course. Now, oh, I gotta take up my wand and then pick a character. Uh, I'm gonna be Mario. Boom. And then you're on the course. Here we go. Ready? Start. Go. Come on. There we go. Ooh, jump over the turtle. Get more coins. Here's a one up. And then go over here. Get the invincibility before it go past this rock thingy. Ah, it almost crashed me. And then we made it. Yay! Ta-da! We have made it. And then for anyone who wants a picture, you put your face in this cutout here. And cha-ching! There you go. Memento for your fabulous run. And then hidden here on these rocks is uh, another sitting area, which I think is cute. I like it. You can go look out into the ocean and wonder if you're ever gonna get off this freaking island. And up here, we have a flower walkway and a pumpkin patch. I used to just have pumpkins here without any decorations, and I was like, eh. But then I made it a little fancier, put some sitting area. Oh, I should um, change out of my Mario costume. And then of course my joysticks are crapping out on me as I'm recording. Cause why not? Anyway, moving on. Up here, we got a little, um, what's it called? Botanical garden? And with little butterfly models and rainbow flowers everywhere. It is very pretty. We gotta run through the cherry blossoms. It is mandatory. And along the way on the path here, we got little um, trinkets that have gone from Gulliver, such as the Tower of Pisa and the, I forget what this is called, um, Eastern Island Head and such, the pyramids. We got a little sitting area over here. And then this ramp goes to my secret beach, which is where I read likes to come and bring me his treasures. So, that's fun. Run, 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 run. And hop. We'll go up there in a second. But then I got my, got my pool over here. With all the lounging and the uh, beach balls. And a dragon that protects Atlantis over there. Hello, Mr. Dragon. 
lifeguard station, cause safety, and such. Oh, and a hot tub, obviously, cause we need a hot tub. And then up here, we got the museum and Rainbow Garden Part 2. I love the Rainbow Garden. It's so pretty. Off to the left here, we have a bit of a stargazing little area, which um, obviously you can't see the stars now because it's um, day. But there's another little stargazing area with Gong. And then we have a little kind of extra display area of all the critters you can see inside the museum. A little silly area with the pond. And another lookout area. And that is my museum. That's pretty much most of the tour. Got a couple more things here to show you. Cross the bridge. Here's my nooks and crannies. And then right outside of it, we have a little farmer's market where I currently am storing all of my turnips. Because, you know, you gotta get them profits. So this is my little farmer's market. You got plants here. You can do art and stuff over here. And then here you can win prizes. I'm gonna say you won this giant thing of cash. Woo! Then almost lastly, this is my house. This is my yard. Got a little patio with a stage and a hot tub, obviously. Got a little pond. Got some relaxing shade over here where we can nap. Snapping's important. My little walkway, flowers, and my garden. Inside my house we go. Welcome. Welcome to my house. Here is my dining room. All um, ironwood stuff, naturally, to get that bonus. Get that home academy bonus of matching thingies. Woo! Got a little kitchen here with the sink. Freezer to store all my things. That apparently holds my clothes. I will not get changed. My pet tarantula up there who um, likes to menace at me because he doesn't like me very much. Off to the, uh, which way is this? Right, we'll go to the right room first. This is my little office. I got more trophies. I got my pet turtle. His name is Frank. Say hi, Frank. He doesn't like me either, as you can see. Then I have more trophies. I have my desk. And then I have all the pictures that I've collected from my villagers who have been best friends with me. Some have since left, but some are still here in my heart. Next room. It's the bathroom. I know, it's super interesting. I got, obviously, I got a toilet. I got a bathtub. I got a shower stall thingy. I got, this is supposed to be a sauna, but it's a cool rock thingy. I got my washing machine. Gotta start the wash. Hold on one second. It's coming, I promise. This, it's coming. There it is. Do you see it? Do you see it turning? And it's wailing stuff. I thought that was cool. Anyway, turn the water on, wash your hands. Go to the bathroom if you need to. Good. I, that makes me feel so much better. And that's the bathroom. Welcome to my blue room. This has all of my blue furniture, or at least a lot of it anyway. Um, this is technically, I call this a spare bedroom, but I was trying to get, you know, all the points I could for home academy so i pretty much just put everything that was the same color in here and my favorite color is blue so therefore we have a blue room this is where i take a nap and then this is where i play nintendo switch and i play animal crossing in animal crossing animal crossing exception woo two more rooms left let's go downstairs i have another mario course we and arcade room. Got a locker, got video games, got darts, and then another Mario thing. Cause you know, I had this floor and this um, wallpaper, so I'm like, I'm gonna do something with it. So, Mario room. Last room. This is my bedroom. It is mermaid themed, as you can see. 
Isn't it pretty? Pretty pink and coral and pastels and all that stuff. Also have my mini shrine here to um, Apple because she is a queen and I love her. But anyway, I got my little desk with my speaker and my little changing area here. And of course, another place to play Animal Crossing for my Animal Crossing section. And yeah, that's my room. Okay, last thing up on Atlantis, because it's my favorite thing ever, is my outdoor library. I just love it so much. Look at it. I got a little reception area here, and then I got a little study area. And you got leaves that you run through because it's outdoors. And you got books everywhere, and I love books. If you know me, you know I love books. You got beautiful scenery with the waterfalls in the back. You got more books. And then up here, to take out your handy dandy ladder, you got a private reading area. Come sit. You can come turn on the lamp here. Oh no, it's off. Turn on the lamp here, sit down, read a book contemplate your thoughts and all that stuff isn't that fun oh oh i totally missed something over here and you have to see it because i also love it <laughs> get the feeling that i just love my island isn't that great isn't that great that i love my island <laughs> so good when i destroy it later oh all those feelings come up and this is my dog park where all the doggies come and play they chew on the bone back there and they live in their little doggy houses and they wag their little tails and they're running around and be happy and it's just a good time here just run around and be happy ah oh, yes good doggies good doggies and that my friends is atlantis i hoped you liked it now i said i was gonna destroy it later and what i mean by that is i'm gonna take down everything and flatten it and i'm gonna redesign the whole thing now like i've said many times i love my island as you can tell by my enthusiastic presentation of it. But I want to try something a little bit different with the terraforming stuff. And I really did that the first time around when I decorated it. So I'm going to try something different. And we're just going to get rid of it all and start again. In the way that, you know, I'm not actually restarting the game. So I can keep all my things. So Anyway, thanks for joining me today. I hope you liked the video. Um, make sure to subscribe to check out more videos on Animal Crossing and hopefully other things. And I'll see you later. Bye!